This is my guitar. It's a simple, high quality piece, but it's in desperate need of some new strings and a little love. I was going to change the strings before recording this, but I decided it was a good metaphor for my point. This is me playing. More than 20 years ago, I was awarded a scholarship for guitar. I've received a great deal of professional training, practiced countless hours, and was good enough to make a living playing and teaching. But that was a former life, and almost all of it's gone. Back then, I could play something as simple as this folksy accompaniment nearly perfectly without really even paying attention. Now, while I still have decent fundamentals, and it may sound okay to some of you, it takes all my concentration. I struggle with the rhythm, my dynamics are clumsy, and the whole thing's a bit sloppy. Why? Well, because it's been a while since I received professional training, and these days I don't play much more than an hour or two a month. This is me shooting. Ten years ago, I belonged to a gun club. I had recently received professional training. I went to the range, twice a week or more. I could draw from concealment and put three shots on an 8-inch plate in 2.5 seconds consistently. I could consistently do the same thing on a torso-sized target while moving. I can't quite do that anymore. I still have decent fundamentals, but I struggle with the consistency. Why? Because it's been a while since I received professional training, and I only shoot twice a month. Now some might tell me that I still play guitar pretty well, and I appreciate that. But in professional circles, I'd be considered a hack at best. I'm nowhere near where I need to be to function in that environment. At the range, I frequently get told that I shoot pretty well. And again, I appreciate that. But I'm nowhere near where I need to be to consistently function at a high level in a high stress situation. Now most of us have to tightly budget both our time and our money. Believe me, I get that. But what we have to keep in mind is that shooting like playing guitar, is a perishable skill. And we often aren't aware of what we've lost or how much we don't know. In addition, even if we could get to the range a little more often, without a professional refresher, we may just be perfecting our mistakes. If you haven't received recent professional training, and maybe you don't get to the range more than once a month, and you still think that you're prepared for anything that might happen to you, you just might be fooling yourself. I'm going to make it a priority to get a professional refresher and to get to the range more often. And if you haven't already, I challenge you to do the same.